Welcome back to the channel Western Iowa Agronomic Update. This week, we'll be talking about early planted soybeans. What are the benefits? What are the risks? And what should you keep in mind if you decide to plant your soybeans early in 2020? So, why even consider planting our soybeans early in the first place? The main reason is that research shows that it can work. Iowa State University research has shown that early planting can increase yield potential for most farmers by anywhere from three to four bushels per acre. Bear Crop Science has evaluated early planting and in 2019, we found really similar results. Now you may be asking, what's the reason for this increase in yield we see when we plant soybeans early? The answer lies in both node count and also pod count. Early planted soybeans generally have more canopy. More canopy means more leaf area, which leads to increased photosynthesis. More nodes, and also more leaves, usually leads to more pods. Some other benefits of that increased plant canopy include moisture conservation in the summer, when soybean plants are going through reproductive growth, and also reduced weed competition early in the season. Now, this all sounds pretty good, right? While there are some benefits, there are also definitely some risks. The main risk is that after emergence, the growing point of those plants is going to be above the soil surface meaning that those soybean plants are now susceptible to freezing temperatures and damage from frost. Another risk that we see from early planting is uh, soybeans being planted into cool, wet conditions. Soybeans can germinate at temperatures below 55 degrees, but th these cold temperatures coupled with wet soil conditions will slow germination and emergence overall, meaning that your soybeans could take up to three weeks to emerge, possibly longer depending on the conditions. When those seeds sit in the, that cold, wet soil for weeks, it opens those emerging seedlings up to pressure from diseases like Fusarium, Pythium, Phytophthora, and also Rhizoctonia. Some other issues we see are compaction and seed placement when we plant soybeans into really cold, wet soils early in the spring. That said, if you're considering planting your soybeans early, here are a few recommendations. The first is seed treatment. Choosing Acceleron soybean seed applied solutions can help protect you from seedling diseases like Rhizoctonia, Pythium, Phytophthora, etc., and also from insects like bean leaf beetles. Another consideration is choosing the right variety to plant early. Picking a fuller season variety that has good SDS tolerance is important. SDS is a disease called sudden death syndrome, and it usually infects the plant early in the vegetative stage when we have cold and wet conditions in the field. The last recommendation is to monitor your planting conditions. Any yield advantage that we pick up from planting beans early can be completely negated if our soil conditions aren't fit, otherwise known as if they're too wet and too cold. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out our Channel Western Iowa Twitter page for more information and for more videos in this series.